Gustav slammed into Cuba with a vengeance. Hacking top winds of 240 kilometers an hour, the monster storm battered Los Palacios in the western part of the island. Before the assault, residents had scurried to protect their precious belongings and livestock. Every year there's a cyclone. We have to come and pick everything up. But this wasn't like every year. It was worse, far worse. Some 7,000 homes, mostly made of flimsy wood and tile roofs, crumbled under the assault. It's the first time I've seen this. I've lived here for 70 years and I've never seen this. It will take days before shell-shocked residents can pick up the pieces of their lives. I could not stay in my house, so I decided to go. But then the raging storm came and I didn't have time to go to the house next door when it collapsed. As Cubans assess the damage, Gustav is racing northwards, sending fear into those in its path.